well, I'm going to be late. Some of my friends are in this band. They're playing at a bar at the university. Way down the bill. Probably going on around 2, 2.30. I said it. Okay. Uh, they're all in the math department. They're really good. They, they have this great song. You'd like it called I, lowercase I. They just stand there and they don't play anything for three minutes. <laughs> <laughs> it's a math joke. You see why they're way down the bill. Long drive, see a bunch of nerds in a band. God, I hate when people say that. It's not that long of a drive. <laughs> oh, they're raging geeks, but they're geeks who, you know, can dress themselves, hold down a job in a major university. Some of them have switched from glasses to contacts. They play sports, they play in a band. They get laid surprisingly often, so they kind of make you question the whole set of terms. Geek, nerd, wonk, dweeb, dilbert, You're in band, aren't you? Yes. <laughs> I play the drums. I never sing, I swear to God. Do you want to come? No thanks. All right. Catherine, Monday. What do you say? Don't you have a job? I have a full teaching load this quarter plus my own research. Don't forget band practice. I don't have time to do this, but if you let me, I'm going to. I loved your dad. I don't believe a mind like his can just shut down. He had lucid moments. He had a lucid year, a full year four years ago. It wasn't a full year, it was more like nine months. It was a school year. He was advising students. I, I was stalled on my PhD. I was this close to quitting. I met with your dad, and he put me on the right track with my research. I owe him. I'm sorry. Look, let me. You're 25, right? How old are you? Listen, it doesn't matter. No, I'm... fuck you. How old are you? <laughs> I'm 28. Well, when your dad was younger than both of us, he made major contributions to three fields. Game theory, algebraic geometry, and nonlinear operator theory. Most of us never wrap our heads around one. But he basically invented the techniques for studying rational behavior and gave the astrophysicists plenty to work on. Don't lecture. I, I'm not. I, I'm telling you that if I came up with one-tenth of the shit your dad produced, I could write my own ticket to any math department in the country. Give me your backpack. What? Give me your backpack. Why? I want to look inside it. What? Open it and give it oh, to me. Oh, come on. You are not taking anything out of this house. I, I wouldn't do that. You're hoping to find something you can publish. Yeah, sure. You can write your own ticket. No, it would be for your dad. It would be under your dad's no, name. I don't believe you, and I think you have something in that bag. What are you talking give about? Give it to me. I think you're being a little bit paranoid. Paranoid? Yeah, maybe a little bit. Fuck you, Cal. I know you have one of my notes. I think that you should calm down and think about what you're saying. I'm Catherine. saying you're lying to me and stealing my family's property. And I'm saying that that sounds paranoid. Just because I'm paranoid doesn't mean you don't have something in that bag. Didn't you just say that there's nothing up there? I would. Th didn't you say that? Yes. So what would I take, right? Right. Thank you. So there's no need to come back. Oh, please, Catherine. Someone should know for sure. I live with him. 